Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to this walkie-talkie application in Microsoft Teams. My name is Jeanette Flores, and I'm very excited to just do this quick demonstration on this new application available on Android or iOS. Before I get started, I work in the technology and training services department, and I do facilitate trainings on different uh, topics or different applications that our campus support. My contact information will be listed at the end of this presentation if you do have any questions or suggestions for me. So the purpose of this training is to highlight one of the newest applications within Microsoft Teams. For those of you that are interested in learning more about the applications that Microsoft Suite encompasses, let me demonstrate how to access your CSUSB Microsoft account. As a CSUSB affiliate, student, staff, or faculty, you have the ability to access many applications that are part of the Microsoft Enterprise Suite. Now, for students, you can access this by going directly to the Microsoft Office 365 login page. You'll use your CSUSB email address without adding Coyote to it. So let me demonstrate this. Okay, once I'm in office.com, I'm gonna select the sign in option and I'll use my nine digit Coyote ID at csusb.edu to continue. Students, please note, there's no need to add coyote at csusb.edu. You can strictly just use your nine digit coyote ID at csusb.edu to continue. From there, you're redirected to our single sign-on. You're gonna log in and then authenticate using Duo. Then I'll be directed to the Microsoft 365 dashboard. From here, you'll notice the app launcher, which gives you a view of all of the applications that are part of our licensing agreement. And therefore, you should be able to launch any of them. Now, if you do need technical trainings on any of these, please reach out to us. So students, you can access the applications just like I recommended. Staff and faculty can also access the applications through the office.com website. But for our staff and faculty community, you can also access Office 365 from the My Coyote portal. And I will demonstrate that momentarily. Okay, once you're logged in, to the My Coyote portal. You can click the faculty and staff email tile. And then from here, you can go to the app launcher and explore the different applications and launch any of them. Again, if you need training on this, please reach out and we can help you with this. Now going back to the walkie talkie app in Microsoft Teams. My first question is, what is the objective of a walkie-talkie? For those of you um, that use walkie-talkies, you know that it's a radio that allows you to talk to multiple people at the same time. So with the use of a walkie-talkie, no phone numbers are needed, no contact information is needed. You wanna contact someone quickly, you just go to the two-way radio to simply tune into the correct channel, and then you'll be communicating with the other person on the other side of the radio. But now Microsoft Team has the Walkie Talkie app that provides that instant push to talk communication for your teams. This is only available on Android and iOS devices. The Walkie Talkie allows users to connect with their team using the same underlying channels they're members of. And then only users who connect to Walkie Talkie in a channel become participants and can communicate with each other. Users will continue to receive transmissions until they tap the stop listening button. And Walkie Talkie supports communicating in standard open channels. It doesn't support or work on shared or private channels. 
With walkie-talkie in Teams, users can securely communicate with a familiar PTT experience without needing to carry those big bulky radios or walkie-talkies. And it works anywhere with Wi-Fi or cellular internet connectivity. This is just a brief demonstration on how it works, but if you do have any questions about this platform, please reach out to us and we can assist you with this. Thank you.